Mala Ai, the culinary garden at Waimea Middle School, is a one-acre outdoor living classroom. An important part of our work is observing and learning from nature, then applying what we learn in all that we do. There are many interesting jobs on Hawaii Island in science, technology, engineering, and math that also require learning from nature and the aina. To find out more about these STEM careers, we went into the field to meet a variety of professionals to learn about the cool and important jobs they do. With two of the world's most active volcanoes, Hawaii Volcanoes National Park is a gorgeous and unique place to work. John Fafford has his dream job there. He's a wildlife ungulate biologist at the park. An ungulate is any animal with hooves, like goats, sheep, deer, and pigs. No ungulates are native to Hawaii, so his job is to keep them out of the park to protect its native plants. Most of the work John and his team do is build and maintain fences and then remove non-native animals from those fenced areas. And what these fences do are um, subdivide our large park, which is over 330,000 acres, into more manageable units. And once the fences are constructed, we go ahead, we have our ungulate control team that goes in and removes the non-native ungulates. And so once the ungulates are removed, we can start restoration where we have a different branch of the natural resources management team go in and plant um, native species. Yeah, so ungulate control is important here in the National Park because we don't have any native ungulates. Whereas in other national parks in the U.S. mainland, um, they have you know elk and deer that are native there, and so the plants have evolved and adapted to having the ungulates browse or graze on the vegetation there. Whereas here, our plants have not had um, the opportunity opportunity to evolve or develop uh, defensive mechanisms. It's important for us to jump in and to assist and help these plants out because they can't protect themselves most of the time. So we try to help the plants um, grow on their own and survive on their own by removing the pigs. When John was a junior in high school, one of his teachers gave his class an assignment to look through magazines and make a presentation on one of the jobs they found in an article. That assignment changed his life. And so I, I, I went through the, the pile of magazines and I grabbed the magazine and actually I have a copy here. It's a National Geographic magazine. It says here, trailing hunting dogs through the thickest reaches of Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, rangers conduct a search and destroy mission for feral pigs. So that caught my interest. And ever since I saw this article, I wanted to work here. So definitely a dream job. I, dream, I dreamt about having a job like this. So during my presentation, you know, um, I brought in a, a pig jaw, I made smoked meat. I, I went all out. I showed a hunting video and I got a good grade on, on that presentation. But more so than anything, this planted the seed. This picture here, this person that's walking through the forest chasing the pigs, his name is Howard. Howard used to sit in this exact seat in this exact office back in the early 90s and I, here I am today in 2020s sitting in a seat. I mean talk about chicken skin. Even before going to college to study biology, John knew a lot about ungulates. He and his brothers spent endless hours hunting with their uncles in the forests above Anahola, Kauai where they lived. After his junior year in high school, he and his brother got summer jobs in those forests through the Department of Forestry and Wildlife. And so my brother and I got the same summer jobs and we loved it. The following year, my senior year, uh, we went back and um, that reaffirmed that I wanted to 
have a job similar to that. That was an introduction to um, helicopters flying out into the remote forests of Kauai, um, building small fence enclosures to plant, uh, protect the native plants there. John decided that college would help him, but he didn't want to go to the mainland. Then he found exactly what he was looking for at UH Hilo, a program in tropical horticulture and environmental science. And so I got a bachelor's degree at UH Hilo. And along the way, I met folks, um, developed friendships with other folks, and my, my web just grew. Um, got connected with people here on the island and you know how it goes you just talk to this person coconut wireless and i found out about a job opening in hawaii volcanoes national park um, got an entry-level position here and um, eventually worked my way up the ladder just proved myself by working hard being dependable um, trustworthy uh, teachable John says the best way to see if you might want to work at the park is to volunteer there first. They have high school age volunteers work with their fencing crews, helping to clear out non-native plants. At the same time, park staff will be checking out the volunteers to see if any of them might be a good fit for a permanent job. Coming in and volunteering here in the park, seeing whether or not you like that field, um, getting to meet folks and network, those are really important in, in helping you figure out what you want to do. John says that sometimes volunteers are so impressive that they are offered paying jobs right after their internships. Almost every time, the same one or two people would not be sitting down when there's nothing to do. Those one or two would always find something to do. And never having to be told, those type of, type of employees really stand out. And as a program manager, not having to micromanage a person is really key because we have a lot going on behind the scenes to, just to keep everything running smoothly. You know, being able to work outdoors, um, have your passion tied into your job. You, like they say, you don't work a day in your life. When, when you enjoy your work. And I feel like I'm, I'm happy here, I'm gonna retire here, I'm gonna give it my all here, I'm, I'm not going anywhere. To explore more job options, visit the Hawaii Career Explorer, a great place to see future high demand STEM occupations. Just search Hawaii Career Explorer online or visit our website, malaai.org.